Okay, so I've switched over to um, the Seduino, and and I've done the weird Seduino has this weird you use these and you connect these two pins these two pins together to put it into bootload a uh, loader mode. You don't have to do it every time, um, but let's just see how things go here. Uh, uploading now. This is the exact same thing that we had before. Um, Oh, interesting, the uh, text elements aren't connected. So let's just see, uh, that worked, but let's see if we can connect this to an input. Uh, what do I want? I want analog, I want outputs actually. There we go, let's just grab this, there's an analog out. And, and let's, I'm just gonna hook up one. Um, so my comms, uh, as I said, you don't always have to reboot that. Let's see if it uh, figures it out. It looks like it's uploading. And it, it didn't upload, so I've got to do this uh, goofy reboot thing. Let me reboot. Now, that is nothing to do with Bizduino. That is to do with Siduino. So let's see where we're at. Reminder, you've always got to be careful with the, the board, uh, the port. It is a Siduino. It hopefully is on the right port. Let's see if we can upload. And this is this one compared to the Nano 33. Uh, no new, oh, there it uploaded. So I switched to my serial port and get the right port and try to connect. There we go. This one's not giving any information, but that one is actually connected, and it's just grabbing some uh, random uh, out from one, uh, digital pin seven. Um, that one's the one that's connected to it right there. You can look in there at the information.